and now I am making us some chicken noodle soup with some chicken breasts that I thawed out. It looks amazing. I added some carrots, some celery, some parsley, salt and pepper. I think I added some onion powder. Sheltered from the sunlight in the shade beneath the tree We hide behind the shadows like an orphaned refugee The apple tree of knowledge shed its fruit along the way The injury is fading but Good afternoon everyone or good morning and welcome back to another vlog. Today it is January 19th, Thursday, and we're going to Giant Tiger. So I'm going to bring you guys along with me and uh, I might go to Dollar Ram as well. And like always, I'm not always going to film in these stores, but I'll try my best. If not, then uh, I'll show you guys outside and we'll go vlog. And I am back. So now I am at Giant Tiger. Thumbnail. So we're going to go in and do a bit of shopping. Let's go. And now I am back outside and now I'm going to the Dollarama just to see if there's any good things. You know, you know what I'm saying, right? So let's go. And I am out of Dollarama. Just got a few things. There's always good things at the Dollarama. Do you guys like shopping at Dollarama? Let me know in the comment section below. Good evening everyone and welcome back to the vlog. Today it is Friday, January 20th. It's about 10.20 right now. This is the first time I'm able to pick up the camera. We were busy most of the day. We went shopping and we were just shopping as a family so I didn't really want to start vlogging. It was just family time. So there's times that I do vlog when, when I go to stores, but there's times that I don't because this is just family time. So right now I am just uh, getting ready for bed. We're just cleaning up uh, the living room and the kitchen. And there's one thing that I do want to talk to you guys all about. So on Facebook and Instagram, I had announced that I was doing a birthday shout outs all over again for the new year, 2017. So I'm just going to give you a few details on what you can do to get your birthday shout outs in. So that way I can make a video for you guys. So first thing is submit your birthday shout outs at least a week in advance. So that way I can get prepared to make that video. So I don't know. So I don't need to be in a rush to make that video and put it the last minute. So give me a week warning and send me an email at the coco show at live.ca for so for now on send me an email at the coco show at live.ca or else i won't be doing any of the birthday shout outs or you can also message me privately on instagram so that way i can sort out throughout all the birthday shout outs that i've received and i know exactly what day i should do the video for and now I am making us some chicken noodle soup with some chicken breast that I thawed out. It looks amazing. I added some carrots, some celery, some parsley, salt and pepper. I think I added some onion powder and a bit of onion salt. And this looks amazing. I'm making a nice chicken broth. I'm going to shred the chicken. Add a bit of noodles. And we got and we're good to go. And now this is what my chicken noodle soup looks like. I, I can't really show you up close without my lens getting fogged up with the steam. But you guys can probably see this. Make some homemade chicken noodle soup with some noodles. Maybe I'll make a homemade chicken and chicken noodle and rice soup. Who knows? Maybe I'll add some adjustment to it. Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome back to the vlog. Yesterday, I didn't vlog yesterday, which was January the 21st. Today is January the 22nd. I thought I'd extend it for an extra day. Make this uh, vlog a little longer, even though I'm not sure if this is going to be longer than the other weeks that I posted but I'll try but 
Right now it is a foggy afternoon. For the past few days it's been really foggy. And it's quite strange because we're in January. Why would it be foggy? We're winter, not spring or fall. So I'm not sure if it's foggy in your area, but let me know where you guys are from and if it's foggy in your area. But with this foggy weather comes this nice cool temperature. It's not so cold where you have to put a winter jacket on. I'm not sure how much is it outside. Open the weather network. I could open AccuWeather, which is more accurate. It's five degrees, January. It's five degrees in January. Feels like one. Let's see if it's gonna snow this uh, this week. No, of course not. They're announcing rain. So we got rain, a bit of snow, but rain mostly and the temperatures are supposed to stay like in the plus tomorrow's supposed to be six tuesday four wednesday eight thursday three and then it's supposed to go down by friday but things could change throughout this week so i'm not really counting on wednesday being eight degrees because it could change but it's kind of i don't know where is the winter Where's the snow? Where's the ice? And all that cold weather. I remember a few years ago at this time, like a few years back, I think it was like 2013 or 14. It was like minus 30. And it, I remember I had done a video outside and that was when I had my flip, uh, flip video camera. And uh, that was like minus 30 with the wind chill. And now in 2017, five degrees weather what is going on with the weather i'm hoping the cold weather comes soon so tomorrow monday it will be january the 23rd and i'll be releasing my food review it will be on the mcdonald's mcchicken i know it's an item that everyone has probably reviewed multiple times but it's one of those items on the McDonald's menu that I haven't reviewed yet. So that will be up by 8 a.m. tomorrow morning, 8 or 9 a.m. So check that out. And if you guys still haven't checked out this week's lineup of, of reviews, I will link all of this week's reviews in the description. So check them all out after watching this vlog. And I am back. So when I came in uh, this afternoon after a vlogging outside, I made supper. We had some meatloaf, mashed potatoes, and corn for dinner. And then now, I think I'm going to have a little bit of a Caesar salad for, for like a little snack, a little healthy snack. So tomorrow, I'm probably going to go to the bank. I have to go to the bank and pay a bill. I'm probably going to do the dishes before we go to bed. And then tomorrow, like I said, the uh, video, the uh, food review will be up on the review channel on the McChicken. So I hope you guys all enjoy that. And I hope you guys all enjoy the reviews that I posted this week on the review channel. And if you guys all did, give this, uh, give all the videos a thumbs up. So the other day when I went to Walmart, I had picked up three of these Soda Stream bottles. Because uh, the other ones that I had before, they were kind of used and it needed to be replaced. So I went to get three of these bottles. Three of these bottles were $20, believe it or not. And I went to get a uh, replacement CO2 cylinder for the carbonation. And if you're a part of the exchange program, it's about $22 and some change. So it's cheaper if you become a part of the exchange program rather than buying a whole new cylinder because the whole new cylinder is about $34 in the exchange program you just bring in your old cylinder and they'll exchange it for a re for a whole new uh, full one and it's like 22 bucks so it saves about about 10 12 bucks so it's cheaper that way so i went to uh to walmart get the new whole new cylinder got some bottles and i made myself a ginger ale i love it i love the soda stream it's so much easier than uh, than just to go buy you know pop and from what i heard it's a little healthier if you do it this way 
I'm not sure if it's because there's less sugar or I'm not sure what makes it a little healthier, but you don't need to just make pop. There's also carbonation, um, like carbonated uh, flavored water or flavored, I think it's just flavored juice. So definitely I recommend if you guys uh, uh, don't have a soda stream, I definitely recommend it. So I'm gonna wrap this vlog up. I hope you guys did enjoy this week's vlog. If you guys did, show your support by giving this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to turn on my post notifications so when I upload a new vlog, you guys get notified and subscribe because that's the way you guys get notified is by subscribing and turn on my post notification. All my links, my social media will be in the description so do follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Facebook for upcoming reviews of vlogs and cooking videos. So until next time, peace out. New food review is now up. It's been up since 8 o'clock this morning. I hope you guys all check it out. Link will be in the bio. Let me know what you guys all think. Watching Smackdown Live. If you guys still haven't checked out yesterday's drink review, you guys can still check it out. The link will still be in the bio. Let me know what you guys all think. I hope you guys all have a great day. Just released a new video, birthday shout out, the first one of 2017. Link's in the bio. Let me know what you guys all think. And if you guys want your birthday shout out, email me at thecocoshow at live.ca. My first Insta story outside. But I want to let you guys know that if you guys still haven't checked out last Friday's food review on the chicken strips, the link will be still in the bio. Check it out and let me know what you guys all think. The weather is very strange lately. Foggy today. And normally fog normally starts in the morning, but it still hasn't disappeared. And it's 5 degrees outside. The review channel is now already at 627 subscribers. Let's see if we can get up to 650 to 700 subscribers by the end of February, and I'll do a giveaway. We're sheltered from the sunlight in the shade beneath the tree. We hide behind.